At the Farm Progress Show, I am in the New Holland exhibit talking with Paul Trella. And Paul, you've got a pretty, I think, neat looking machine on display out here, powered by hydrogen. Tell me a little bit about this. Oh, we're excited to show this to the public. It's actually a, our first tractor where we've taken the traditional diesel engine out of the tractor and replaced it with a very simple system that includes a hydrogen storage tank, a hydrogen fuel cell, and an air compressor. So instead of running a diesel engine, we typically have, we take hydrogen gas, run it through a fuel cell to create electricity, and power an electric motor that powers the rest of the tractor. So gone are the diesel emissions, gone are all the pollutants, gone is a stack, the exhaust stack, and what you have in, in this place is a very efficient system to provide power that is also very clean, zero emissions, and very quiet. This tractor will run outside about a DBA of about 55, as opposed to a traditional tractor that could be up close to 80. So we have an extremely quiet machine. But the whole concept is really just a piece of something bigger we call the energy independent farm. Our vision is farmers of the future can incorporate this into their farmstead, but they could also use things like the sun, the wind, biogas, methane generators to produce their own electricity. And as they do that, they're not only powering the farmstead, but they're also developing a capability of providing and creating and generating their own hydrogen. And they can store that then for use in their tractors and equipment in the future. So they become slightly more energy independent than they are today. Great. Now, uh, what about uh, availability and uh, things like, uh, I know the first thing I might ask is, well, when and where can I get when one? When can I order one? That's a question that we've gotten the most. And I have to be a little sensitive to sure. my mindset says, you know, in 20 years we may see something, which really means in 5 to 10 years we may see something. I have no doubt that in the next 5 to 10 years we will see hydrogen available, commercially available, as a, a fuel to power equipment. When that happens and the hydrogen fuel cell technology continues to evolve and become more economical, I have no doubt in 10 years' time we'll see equipment running with a system similar to this. All right, well, I'm going to back up just a little bit here so we can get a, a full uh, look at this tractor because it, it's, it's a large size and I don't have a real wide angle lens here, but uh, this is the tractor that is on display here at the New Holland booth. And uh, like I said, I think it's a pretty sharp looking looking machine, uh, Paul, and I want to thank you. Anything else that uh, you might tell people about uh, no, this I'm technology? Just, I'm just tickled that New Holland has taken a position of being proactive and thinking about the future of agriculture, the future of what power for the agricultural of the, uh, farm of the future is going to look like. Because we, we do need to, to explore all options so that we are prepared when things start changing. And that's, uh, that's one of the things that this concept is trying to prove out. We're actively looking at the future with an eye to what makes the most sense for the farmer. All right. Thank you very much, Paul Trello with New Holland. Looking at this uh, new NH2, I believe we call it, uh, tractor that they've got on display here at Farm Progress Show. I'm Chuck Zimmerman.